what the narcissist is thinking about you. If you were a good source of supply to the narcissist and then you left them or they discarded you, they will be thinking about you. They will be thinking about the benefits and conveniences you brought to them. They will be thinking about how you helped them. But they won't be thinking about your enjoyable moments or happy occasions. Narcissists don't experience sentimental value. Instead of personal or emotional associations, they're more focused on its material worth. They don't place importance to you because of a connection or because of good times. You're not special to them. There's no nostalgic value. All they think about is the supply you provided to them, how much they could take from you, especially if you gave them money or a place to stay. If you move on and you make more money or you buy a new car, they will be thinking about you because that's what they want. And maybe they can't get that from someone else. Maybe they valued you because you were physically attractive and that's what they are thinking of when you're gone. Or maybe you were their doormat. You were their emotional punching bag. And they're thinking about how much you used to let them get away with. They're thinking about how you used to believe their lies. How you would fall for their gaslighting. Especially if they're with someone else. Who's not like that. Because with you, everything was easy. They could get you to do whatever they want. But maybe the new person they're with is more challenging for them to deal with. Maybe they have to put in a lot of work. Because you are at their beck and call. When they texted you, you responded to them instantly. You answered their calls. You were there when they needed you. Because they trained you to be that way. They turned you into their pet or slave. And that is what they will miss. That is what they will be thinking about when you're gone. They won't be thinking about your love. They won't be thinking about your empathy or compassion. That means nothing to them. They will be thinking about your money or your physical attractiveness. They will be thinking about the things you gave to them. Which really has nothing to do with you. You're just something they use to make themselves look better. You're just someone who supplies something to them. They don't miss you as a person. They miss you as an appliance. They miss you as someone who produces something for them. Just look back at your relationship with them. Remember how many times you tried to cuddle. Remember how many times you tried to kiss them. And they turned you away. They rejected your love. Because that doesn't matter to them. That didn't do anything for them. Which is why it was so easy for them to turn you away. 
So they're not going to miss you for that. They're going to miss you as their source of supply. People are just objects that they use and then throw away. So even if they've found someone else, that's what they're going to be doing. They're not going to value their relationship. There's not going to be any love. It's just a transaction. It's an exchange of benefits. It has no sentimental value. It's not special. When you go no contact with a narcissist, they will be thinking about you. Because you're like the one that got away. And you will know that they're thinking about you. Because they will hoover you. And they will do that when they realize that their new supply isn't fulfilling their promises and obligations. They will want you back. But if you do let them back in, it will be even worse than before. And it won't last for long. But this is how you know that they're thinking about you. Just remember how they always used to compare you to other people. When they find someone else, they're comparing them to you. You set the standard for what they expect now, and they will brag and boast about you to anyone they meet. They will tell them everything you did. They will tell them how much money you spent on them. They will say that you are this wonderful person, but they will never say that to you because they support and engage with both sides of the competition. They do it in a duplicious manner to benefit their own interests and agenda. So even though they may have put you down and told you you're not good enough, they will use you to get what they want from the next person. They will say that you were amazing they will say that you did everything. They will triangulate you with their new supply to get them to do what you used to do. So when you go no contact, they will be thinking about you. It will cause a narcissistic injury But if you don't go no contact, they will still be thinking about you. And they will just see you as a fool. They will know that they can come back whenever they want to. And they will be expecting you to take them back. But whatever happens, they will be thinking about you. Especially if you cut them off. They will be thinking that you were incredible. But you don't need to worry about that. You just need to continue on your path to purpose. You need to forget about the narcissist and leave them in the past. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.